Hey guys, so I didn't have a shopping haul last week. I got bread and milk and wasn't really planning on going food shopping and then we went away and we spent about £30, just under £30 while we were away at Sainsbury's and we did not get a lot for that 30 quid. We got a couple of bits of salad and stuff like that that we needed while, while we were there. So yeah, let me show you exactly how much I spent and what I picked up today at Morrison's. I did really well. So I spent £16.25. pence. I did take some clips of, they had stacks of green boxes with lots of yellow labels in. So I'll insert that footage now. to get to it though it's like just all stacked on top of each other it was a bit of a challenge to go through the boxes and find things because they were stacked quite high um and they're very heavy to lift up and see what's underneath them so i got i got what i did um i picked up three cans of guinness for danny this was 49 pence two of these air fresheners these were 120 i have a toilet downstairs and a bathroom upstairs so i picked up two i picked up some cat food for drinks it was only 18p so i thought i'd give it a try as well as a new collar for one pound 13 which isn't a great discount but i thought it's cute and then fruits and veg there wasn't a lot there today i did get some salad for 32 pence carrots were 25 pence blueberries were a good deal at 93 pence and then bananas 24 pence i got these Chicken strips, these were 40 pence, that's a good deal. Bacon was a 55. Ready meal for Danny to take to work was 35 pence. This is really good, I got some pack up bits. So the pepperonis were 50 pence. And these little smoothies on a stick were 18 pence, that is a really good deal. I got some coleslaw for 22 pence. A whole rate of different types of yogurts, so this one was 18 pence. 16 pence, 16 pence, two of them, and then I've got a few of these for eight pence. Cherry is my favourite flavour of yogurt. I did pick up some Singapore rice noodles, they were 38 pence, three of them is enough for a meal. Some tomato garlic bread, 20 pence. These was also a part of that big green stack of food, so some cup of soups for 48 pence. They had loads of soup, so I picked up four for 18 pence. Chunky vegetable and beef looked good. This looked very interesting. 40 pence is worth a try, isn't it? Some vanilla tea bags, 47 pence. Mince pies were 23 pence. These looked really good, these chocolate tarts, 23 pence. Birthday cake, it's no one's birthday, but for 120 the boys will definitely enjoy that and then two packs of crisps for 72 pence each so here's the second part to my shopping haul we are having a pizza night tonight with friends so i picked up a few pizzas some other snacks and while we were shopping i thought let's just get a few other bits um i did pick up alcohol as well but i paid for that separately just so it's easier um, because that is a different budget so let me show exactly how much i spent and what i got so we spent £58.28, and pence. so for non-food items I did need polish, washing up liquid, toilet roll, cling film, grease proof, baking paper and black bags. I didn't need any meats or any fruits or vegetables, I did pick up some meat slurs and some pepperamis, cheese sticks for the kids pack up, milk, cheese, Marge, soft cheese, some little yogurts for Ella and Ollie, and then like I said, a stack of pizzas. 
these ones look really really good they didn't have many pizzas there so we had to get the essentials range and um, they did have these which look really good but these oh my gosh spinach and ricotta flatbread yum it's all in the packaging isn't it and then some tortilla crisps and some dip roller cola lemonade cranberry juice crisps for the boys at pack up beef gravy coffee sugar raisins i put these in a big jar and then ollie puts them into a little pot and takes them as a pack up cookies jammy wheels and two loaves of bread so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next one take care bye